So yesterday I asked you, what would you do if you won the Super Bowl? I'm Australian, go choke on a cho, Jack. Off to a good start. What book deserves a sequel and what would its title be? Fifty Shades of Grey, the picture book, pop-up edition. What is the best way to dump someone, deflate her and put her back in the box? What flavor of Oreo cookie do you want to see? The toothpaste Oreo, so now you don't have to fill it with toothpaste yourself. If you could change any movie ending, what would you change? Old Yeller comes back to life. And they shoot him again. Describe your sex life with a movie title. Bloodsport. What song do you party to? Crawling by Linkin Park. What's your weapon of choice in the zombie apocalypse? My dad, because he sure hits pretty hard. What's the best way to tell your crush that you like him or her? Give him a cute nickname like Twinkle Toes. Or fuck boy. Write me the loveliest Roses Are Red poem. Roses are red, shampoo tastes bad. I hope you don't leave, just like my dad. <laughs> Who should replace Jon Stewart when he leaves The Daily Show? Jesus, he died for your grins? <laughs> Give me a good acronym for love. Lol, oops, varted everywhere. <laughs> Describe YouTube in four words. Get a real job, can't get a real job. Real jobs, no way. <laughs> what is the meanest insult you can think of that doesn't have curse words? You make blind kids cry. That's fucked up. Where's the best place to hide the body? Ask Siri, she'll know. Where can I hide the body? What, again? <laughs> well played, Siri. What song do you make love to? The song that plays after you get the flagpole in Mario. Why does Kanye love Kanye so much? Kanye has his own religion, AKA Kanyeanism, in which Kanye is his own God. So Kanye has to worship himself or he'll go to Kanye hell. That makes a lot of sense. Help me write a song. I would provide the music and you would provide the lyrics. I only watch your videos while I'm high. Songs are hard, but so am I. Who would you thank in your acceptance speech? I'd like to thank my HIV for always staying positive. What is your biggest fear? My biggest fears are bridges, bridges, and bitches. What turns you on? Do animated chicks count? <laughs> no. What would your last words be? Tell my wife I love her, sister. Tell me the meaning of life in four words. It doesn't get better. Notice how this one can be used both positively and negatively. It doesn't get better than this, or it doesn't get better. If you could time travel, where would you go and what would you do? Force Abraham Lincoln to say, you can't believe everything you see on the internet. Very nice. Give me your most devastating yo mama jokes. Yo mama's so stupid she decided to keep you. That one's evil. If you only had one day left to live, what would you do? If I had one day left to live, I'd message 10 people on Facebook saying that if they don't forward the message to 10 other people, I would die tomorrow. Good one. What song do you want to be played at your funeral? Ding dong, the witch is dead. If you were president of the United States, what would your first order of business be? Legalize fun. What are some top 10 lists you would like to see? Top 10 porn positions. Oh, it's so cute. You call them porn positions. If you had a hundred million Twitter followers, what would you tweet? Hashtag twooping. Is, is twooping what I think it is? Let me, let me check online. Yep, just saw an urban dictionary. That is exactly what it sounds like. Thanks guys. Describe the Apple watch in four words. Hard to watch porn, but possible. If God is real, what would you say to him? Hey, congratulations on boobs. Two thumbs way up. What video game describes your sex life? World of Goo. <laughs> what movie deserves a sequel and what would its title be? Les Miserables 2, Still Miserable. <laughs> What's the first thing you do when you wake up in the morning? Cry internally, cry externally, cry eternally. <laughs> if we could make every comment the same, hashtag same movement 2015. And this started to spread like wildfire. This was way better than the, the same trend. But much like everything else that is beautiful, the internet killed it. Hashtag maim movement. What makes a man a man? Not letting girls into his treehouse. Make me cringe in four words. I do fedora tricks. <laughs> Fill in the blank. I love you more than blank. I love you more than Satan. Santa. Santana. Who should replace Zane in One Direction? Yoko Ono. If you were a pro wrestler, what would your wrestler name be? And what's your finishing move? My name would be The Clock because time is everybody's worst enemy. And my final attack would be time because time is everybody's worst enemy. To help me write Jaden Smith's next tweet. Why turn the frown upside down when you can just smile? Great April Fool's Day prank. I put Kool-Aid in the toilet. So when someone flushes it, red stuff comes out. Thanks, dad. Write the saddest story you could think of in just four words. I only need two. 
write a haiku about your favorite video game. Bishop to h5, knight to h5, takes bishop. Oh shit, checkmate, mate. <laughs> a really cool background to put behind me for the next episode of Yai. A background of you being in front of a background, that's of you in a background. Why do we love taking selfies so much? We love our selfies so much because we love ourselvesies so much. <laughs> write your best roses are red, violets are blue poem. Doritos are red, Illuminati has triangles. The government has fallen and is run by reptiles. What feature would you want to see in your next smartphone? A working pregnancy app. I've been peeing on my phone for hours now. What's the next video game that should be made into a movie? Dawn of the rise of the video game of the movie of the planet of the apes. The game. The movie. <laughs> if your pet could talk, what would it say? Please let me out of the oven. Describe the internet in four words. Harmony. Friendship. Respect. Sarcasm. What would your yearbook quote be? literally his yearbook quote, so people could say his yearbook quote was literally his yearbook quote. What turns you off when she's over 15 years old? Come on, describe your perfect date night. Well, bang, okay? What makes a woman a woman? Knowing all the lyrics to every Disney song. Great workout tips. Bite the pillow when your bro works you hard. Help me write a song. I killed a man, make that too. Illuminati is controlling you. What are your best life hacks? Have unprotected sex at night while the sperm is sleeping. Realize they're actually figments of your imagination. Who is your man crush Monday? Paul Blart, mall cop. Ruin my childhood in four words. Please, Luigi, use lube. Let me interpret your dreams. I ate pizza. This symbolizes your craving for pizza in the morning, pizza in the evening, pizza at supper time. But when pizza's on a bagel, you can eat pizza anytime. Some new challenge ideas. The never do a challenge challenge. It's impossible to win because if you never do a challenge, then you've done the never do a challenge challenge, which also means you didn't do the never do a challenge challenge. How do you impress a girl? By every amiibo. <laughs> Fill in the blanks. We go together like blank and blank. We go together like Internet Explorer and ruin a relationship in just four words. Hi, I'm Jack Douglas. God damn it. How can we solve world hunger? Send fat Americans to Africa and send hungry Africans to America. Problem solved. What is the best way to quit your job? Carpool with your boss, and when you pass his house, say, hey, that's my old boss's house. What are some cool new swear words? You bucket of water. What are the rules of the internet? When your mom comes in, switch to porn so that she doesn't catch you watching Jack's films. <sighs> What is the absolute worst thing you could say on a first date? I brought my son to watch. <laughs> what is your best Kickstarter idea? Send someone to Uranus and carve it into a butt. Uranus is a gas planet, so you won't be able to carve it into anything. Blow my mind in six words or less. A brain prostitute. Yes, I suppose that would blow my mind. <laughs> what is your dream fight? You versus all the commenters who didn't get featured on Yai. Shit. What is your best motivational quote? Any pizza can be a personal pizza if you try hard. Woman Crush Wednesday. Sarah Jessica Parker. I'm into bestiality. Yay, that's a good one. When did you realize you weren't a kid anymore? When I couldn't have tricks anymore. Stupid slogan. What are your relationship goals? Sexy time. Huh, is it dated reference day already? Very nice, how much? Do I make you horny, baby? Is that your final answer? Where's the beef? Please celebrate dated reference day responsibly. Describe Facebook in four words. I'm not racist, but... Last minute Mother's Day gift ideas. Mother's Day was a week ago for me. What a stupid gift. What word or phrase should officially be retired? Kissing. Face battle sounds better. Oh my god, yes, I love that. Face battle. What is the absolute worst thing you could say after sex? Well, you still got it, Dad. <laughs> Fun things you can do with the GoPro. And your answers were really cool and unique. <laughs> what is your favorite thing to do in bed? I go to sleep when my dad stops shouting. What would you do if you had a cloning machine? Clone a genie for more wishes. See, that's brilliant. What is the best way to cheer someone up? Episode nine of season three of Game of Thrones. That's the Red Wedding. If you were a superhero, what would your name and superpower be? Power, invisibility, name, perverto. <laughs> How do you escape the friend zone? Revealing the shrine. Describe white people in just four words. Wow, delish quinoa, Susan. <laughs> I just got whiter by saying that. Fill in the blank. 
A blanket day keeps the doctor away. Cyanide pill, because you will be dead. Yes, we get it. <laughs> How I can get to two million subs because I am so close and yet so far. Never make any videos, you stupid fat gaffer. <laughs> what is the worst thing you could say at a funeral? Should have forwarded that chain mail. What annoys you the most? What really grinds your gears? What's your biggest pet peeve? Grinds my gears when people use their phones while I'm talking to them. Grinds my gears when your mom is on the phone when I'm doing it. <laughs> How do you want to die? Tomorrow. How to be a thug in four words. Fuck money, get bitches. Money, bitches, get fucked. Get fuck money, bitches. <laughs> if you were immortal for a day, what would you do? Go to the hood and shout the you know what word. Uh, Voldemort. 30 days ago, I asked you, nay, challenged you to create something using tutorials from lynda.com slash jack. Our first submission is a song from Millie who remixed, you'll hear it. Yesterday, I asked you what turns you off. Here are your best answers. Light switch, a light switch, light switch, a light switch, light switch, a light switch. Hold on, it gets better. Light switch, 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 light switch. So sick. <laughs> Can only go downhill from here, guys. What is the worst time to faint? Fainting is for pussies. Always go full coma. How would you break the internet? You know, kind of like how Kim Kardashian didn't. By not misusing the term break the internet, you fucking normie. <laughs> hey, what are you doing this weekend? Yesterday I asked you what- Crushing the patriarchy. And your mom. <laughs> cool new acronym for PETA. Pretending everything threatens animals. That one's a genius. What are some new Starbucks flavors that you would like to see? Jack's Films flavor. Oh wait, too stale. Got a, I got 189 likes. Thanks, guys. Describe religion in just four words. Scientology even spooks Christians. Your best tips for job interviews. Murder the boss, then wear his skin to work. This really works, thanks. What are your best icebreakers? Any of the puns from Batman and Robin. Ice to see you. If you were a world-class hacker, what would you hack into? I would hack into the White House and make it a purple house. I don't think that's how hacking works. What's on your bucket list? A bucket list is a list of things you want to do before you die or kick the bucket. Go to the olive bar and get cheese so it keeps on going. <laughs> okay, Google? What the fuck is an olive bar? <laughs> no idea what you said there, buddy. <laughs> what are your best dad jokes? To rate these jokes, I've installed this handy chronometer, which measures the cringe factor of every joke. What are you drinking, son? Soy milk. Hola, milk. Soy is too padre. Oh, come on. What is the best way to tell your kid they're adopted? Tell them that they're not adopted, then wink at them. Help me write a song. Help me hide the body. Help me hide the booty. Lots of traps are always marked by a booty. Describe teenagers in just four words. Beat, meet, sleep, repeat. <laughs> Some new commandments. Thou shalt not wham and bam without thanking the ma'am. <laughs> your best parenting tips. Don't take away your kids' electronics. Take away their chargers and see their phone time get shorter and shorter. That is genius. What should I get Aaron, my girlfriend, for her birthday? A kiss album. <laughs> What's an acronym for memes? Memes enlighten my euphoria sensors. Describe Disney in just four words. Creating unrealistic expectations forever. How should I celebrate my birthday with all of your friends? Oh wait, <laughs> what would you tell the haters? No pickles on my burger, please. <laughs> that one's fucking amazing. Who would you add to Smash Brothers and what would their final smash be? Character Hank Hill, final smash propane. Tips on how to be a successful YouTuber. Here are your best answers. Mm. Step one, get a hot girlfriend. Step two, let people know you have a hot girlfriend. Hands off, fellas, she's taken. Tell me in four words, what makes America, America? Fried bacon wrapped guns. What are your best pickup lines? Are you from China? Because I'm China fuck. <laughs> what killed the dinosaurs? Uh, dinosaurs aren't real. Check your Bible. Your best sex tips. Reply to all of your partner's dirty talk by shouting, yas. <laughs> I hate that word. When is the worst time to get a call from your grandmother? When you're getting your bumble scrumbled. What do you want to be when you grow up? Or alternatively, what did you want to be when you grew up? I want to be a kindergarten teacher so I can ruin people's dreams early. An acronym for friends. Frequently, Ross is embarrassed and denied sex. Oh, so good. Describe anime in just four words. Very unrealistic boob physics. I would know. How do you sleep at night? I'd sleep better if I knew you were dead. Good lord. Some tips on going to a convention. Make sure it's a porn convention. That way you'll have- 
<laughs> that way you'll have all the tips you need. What should I green screen in the background behind me? Green screen all of the comments that you're going to say this episode, so for people that just dip in to see if they're on Yai today, won't actually have to watch the whole episode. Smart idea. If you could shrink down in size, what would you do? Put on a tiny devil outfit and stand on people's shoulders. What's the coolest thing to say while walking away from an explosion? I blew up your house. Tee hee hee. <laughs> what should I read or say while using a speech jammer? For those that don't know, a speech jammer is a type of app that replays everything you say. Ah, ah. Replays back everything you say, but with a slight delay, so it kind of fucks up with your speech. Betty bought her, bought some butter. But she said the butter's bitter. If I put in my batter, it'll make my batter bitter. But a bit of better butter will make my batter better. Describe fan bases in just four words. Fans are never satisfied. Hey, nice acronym. Your best dieting tips. Take your favorite food and cut it in half. That way, it's only half the calories, and because it's half the calories, you can have twice as much. Genius. Where do babies come from? I just, I just really wanna know. Forget that. What is baby powder made of? Great, now I won't be able to sleep tonight. What would you say to your 100-year-old self? Mummy. <laughs> write a moving story in just 10 words. YouTube is a real job, John cried in the closet. Did you have to use my real name? Consider me moved. Your nerdiest joke. What do a neutrino and I have in common? Uh, we are both constantly penetrating your mom. What's a new acronym for YOLO? You're a forehead, Liz a huge. <laughs> Describe Yai in just four words. Terrible answers, terribly narrated. <laughs> if you were invisible for a day, what would you do? I'd beat up a mime so that everyone would think he's the greatest mime alive, genius. How will the world end? With a freeze frame and a where are they now for all seven billion of us. insults without cursing. I'm not disappointed, I'm just mad. <laughs> Best get rich quick tips. Hard work and effort. <laughs> That's cute. If a genie granted you one wish, what would you wish for? I'd wish to bring back the most beloved genie of all time. Miss you every day, old buddy. <laughs> what are some honest product slogans? Applebee's, let us reheat your frozen food. What can you say about your car that you can't say about your girlfriend? If you squeeze in real tight, you can fit six people in it. <laughs> Describe Apple in just four words. I like your money. <laughs> For your best hangover cure. I'm Irish, what's a hangover? Your best band name. Resting Bitch Face. That's an awesome name for a band, actually. The internet's down for a week. What do you do? <gasps> yes! Fill in the blank. You know what they say. A comment a day still won't get me in yai, but it just did. If I were an employer, why should I hire you? I was Time Magazine's Person of the Year in 2006. Whoa, that's really impressive. Except, wait a minute, we all were that year. Describe the 90s in just four words. What are hashtags for? Yo, back in my day, they were called pound signs and they didn't do shit. What would you do if you had a million dollars? I'd buy my girlfriend a real boyfriend. What would YouTubers do without YouTube? What? Go back to hell where they all came from. Tips on becoming popular. Be able to recite 100 digits of pi. Whoa, buddy, I asked you how to be popular, not how to be a babe magnet. Best roses are red poems. I love these so much. Roses are red, violets are magenta. I've never had a baby, but I've eaten placenta. What's the worst thing to say at a wedding? I thought white symbolized purity. <laughs> Describe Tumblr in just four words, let's do this. Doesn't do good laundry. Clever. What would you do if you were the last person on Earth? Go on all YouTube videos and write last. What are the rules of YouTube? Troll unto others as they troll unto you. What's your theme song? The clapping section of the Friends theme song on constant repeat. <laughs> Spoil a movie in just four words. Bruce Wayne is... What? What's one thing she hates to see in the bedroom? Plastic wrap everywhere. Tips on how to survive college. Put a sock in the door every night so people think you always get laid when you are actually watching Naruto. It's a good life hack. Your most useful studying tips. Mary Rich, tell me your dreams so that I could interpret them for you. I had a dream where everyone I loved and cared for died. Well, that dream will come true one day. That's a fact, Jack. Tell me what happiness is in just four words. Making people genuinely smile. That one goes to the trash. <laughs> Fill in the blank. When life gives you lemons, blank. When life gives you lemons, take videos of babies eating them and get popular on Facebook. That will work. What is the best way to propose to someone? 
by proposing as a plane lands so you can be sure everyone will clap. How do you take the perfect selfie? Be a white girl, stand in front of the Starbucks sign, eating Chipotle while hugging a small dog. That is the whitest thing I've ever heard of. And I love it. Different acronyms for USA. Unsubscribed. Sucks ass. <laughs> what should a smart watch do? What a dumb watch doesn't. Brand new inventions that could change the world. A lollipop with an edible handle. That's great. Describe the new iPhone success in just four words. Slim. Amazing. Mesmerizing. Exp oh, I see what you did there. What is the best way to prevent spoilers? Be the spoiler. <laughs> Describe fall in four words. Here we go. Sweaters hide weight gain. What are some alternate pronunciations or spellings of the name Benedict Cumberbatch? Battle Toad Cancer Bath. A month ago, I asked you to make something, anything, using tutorials from lynda.com. Aaron Durning says, hey Jack, this is a game what I made. No, I refuse to believe you made a video game. That sounds, no, that's that's probably a virus. I'm gonna click on it anyway, because I'm really dumb. Shut up. Jack's Films Five Heads Flight? Is this an actual working video game? Oh my God, yes it is. What's your best fake Donald Trump quote? Charmander Trump's Bulbasaur. <laughs> Fill in the blank. Keep calm and blank. Keep calm and prosper. No, wait, fend me in just four words. I can take it. Birkenstocks. I don't want to read this one. Your best shaving tips. I'm a woman. Wow, sexist much women shave too. If you just got dumped, what do you do? Celebrate. <laughs> what is your life motto? No fat chicks, no skinny chicks, no chicks, just anime. What a twist. Create a new flavor for a protein bar. Creamy Mimi. Create an acronym for Jack. Jury acquits child killer. What's a cool tattoo I should get? Subscribe button and a QR code underneath it. Brilliant. Describe your favorite movie with a haiku. Tom Hardy and friends drive to find some more water. Then they drive right back. You describe Reddit in just four words. Commenters only read title. I am very guilty of that. What are your best traveling tips? Pick up basketball, take four steps. This took me way too long to get. What is the best way to spend a Friday? Fall right in dead ass. Yes. <laughs> That's a really good acronym. Design a new video game. Helen Keller simulate. If you could bring one item with you on a deserted island, what would it be? I would bring Rick Astley because he said he never desert me. What award category should they add to the Oscars. Best misleading trailer for a crappy film, yes. When is the worst time to sneeze? When someone says, sneeze if you support Hitler. Yesterday, I asked you to fill in the blank. If you can't beat him, blank. Turn the difficulty down. Scare me in just four words. Sonic gently touched Amy. <laughs> Tips on how to write a hit song. G sharp, A sharp, F sharp, G sharp. Or right, hold on, let me get to the piano. What is your costume for Halloween this year? Big bad boner daddy. <laughs> Describe the O's in just four words. Give this video five stars. Some cool new NBA teams. The Florida Fedoras. Or the Fedoras for short. <laughs> new themes for birthday parties. Death, funeral, death. Funeral, death, funeral, death, funeral, death, death, funeral, funeral, death. Cliches or stereotypes that are prevalent in anime. He's tougher than anyone I've ever fought, but I'm gonna beat him no matter what. Design a new flag for Antarctica soon. Wow, this is this one's actually depressing. What are you thankful for? I'm thankful for being. The I'm thankful for being the best memer out there. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> best Black Friday shopping tips. Don't, don't. Don't, 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 don't. Describe Twitter in just four words. Relatable savage bay vines. <laughs> Fill in the blanks. Damn girl, are you blank? Because blank. Damn girl, are you an iPhone? Because you keep getting bigger. <laughs> Describe Christmas in just four words. Santa hates poor kids. <laughs> what are some of life's ultimate burning questions that need answering? Chicken first or egg first? Good question. I usually do eggs in the morning for breakfast, then chicken for dinner. Lunch if I'm feeling frisky. Yesterday, somebody you've never heard of 
asks you, what is love in four words? Ice cream for one. Fill in the blank. All I want for Christmas is blank. All I want for Christmas is Aaron hosting Yai full time. Come on, she wasn't that funny. Aaron a host Yai. Aaron a host Yai. For Aaron to take over your channel. Aaron a host because then I can see things other than a talking. Summarize Star Wars in just one sentence. Three chipmunks go on wacky adventures as pop singers. No. About a month ago, I asked you to make something, anything, using tutorials from lynda.com, and you guys knocked it out of the park this time. YouTuber D4E Joe Bro made a video called Dragon Ball Jack. Here's a clip. I'm gonna mess you up. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> it's wonderful. The amount of skill and creativity and talent and comedic timing, it boggles my mind. There's even a not safe for work bit that I couldn't include that cracks me up like a little schoolgirl every time I hear it. What are your New Year's resolutions? Just overlook haters' negativity, cherish everything, never, oh my god, it spells John, John Cena. Cena. Describe 2015 in just one sentence. Hello, it's me, John Cena, and you know when his highline bling and the dress was black and blue, not white and gay. <laughs> that was the most painful thing to read. Your predictions for the year 2016. Yas will be replaced by something more annoying, not not possible. New yas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quickest way to make me cringe. Yeah. Create a brand new anime show. Dragon Ball SJW. <laughs> best of 2015 lists that you would like to see. The best comments that weren't featured on Yai. Or as I like to call them, the best of the trash. What's the best way to shut someone up? Torture them. Mm, you know what's torturing me? Your spelling of the word torture. Beautiful baby names. Emo baby 48 but it's pronounced Earl. What are some tips on leaving the perfect YouTube comment? Find the video you want to comment on. Make sure it's something you're passionate about. If you aren't confident on your, oh my God, it all spells first. That is a trolling on a different level. Alternate pronunciations of the name Donald Trump. Doof troop. <laughs> some acronyms for the word drunk. Don't rub us naked, Carl. Not after last time. Describe winter in just four words. Look, mom, I'm smoking. Am I right? Name our brand new puppy. Sonic the edgy dog. <laughs> she doesn't like that one. Fill in the blank. If it ain't broke, blank. If it ain't broke, keep using the old Yai questions. Hell yeah, baby, sequels till I die. Redesign the American flag. Yes, the new American flag should be a picture of the American flag printed on a fedora. I agree. <laughs> if you had 100 million subscribers on YouTube, what would your next video be? Losing 100 million subscribers in five days challenge. Yes, I would watch that. Share some amazing facts that most people don't know. A group of white dads is called a sandal. <laughs> if you could be anyone else for a day, who would you be? Myself. See, it was a test and you passed. You're the only one that passed the test. How are you gonna celebrate the one year anniversary of Yai? Setting the flag at half mast, for that is the correct reaction to a tragedy. Alternatives to Netflix and chill. Nickelodeon and fuck. <laughs> How to be funny in four words. Don't be a YouTuber. Shit. How are you gonna make America great again? By making other countries voice. An acronym for vote. Voicing opinions threatens everyone. Help me make Valentine's Day cards. I really like this one a lot. It's, it's, just a, it's a great, it's great, it's a great. An alternative title to the movie Deadpool. X-Men Origins, The Apology. What's the best way to get over your ex? Date their daughter. How to lose your friends in just four words. Rawr, nuzzles you, ugh. That'll do it. Caption this photo of Aaron holding her two dogs. This woman figured out how to give birth to puppies. Doctors and vets hate her. Fill in the blank. Life is like a box of chocolates, blank. Life is like a box of chocolates. I hate the vegan ones. <laughs> Redesign the movie poster for Superman versus, for Batman versus Superman. Uh. I like this one a lot because it shows how vulnerable Batman truly is. Mayhaps he represents mankind's vulnerability to tackle their everyday problems. What TV show describes your sex life? Big Brother. Boo. What are some fun things to do with your parents? Play a drinking game. Put in a movie with lots of sex scenes in it. And if someone acts noticeably uncomfortable, they have to take a shot. Let me acronymize your names. Ashton, mm, I love five seconds of Ashton. Here we go. You know what Ashton is? 
A silly hoe that I don't know. <laughs> Help me write an anime episode, sentence by sentence, comment by comment. And it wasn't easy, but somehow we pulled it off. And he fought and he fought, but the memes were just too spicy. Describe drinking in just four words. Chug, 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 chug. Your worst compliment. Your dick is way bigger than your brother's. That's fucked up. What would you do if Trump became president? Move the fuck away. Help me design a new emo <clears throat> emoji. Ooh, the stank eye emoji. Me likey. How you plan on celebrating this most sacred of months. I'll go make people cringe at the karaoke bar. That's my specialty, baby. Your deepest, darkest secrets. I used to tell my ex-boyfriend that one color was another to convince him he was colorblind. Wow, what's up, Satan? What are some alternatives for the phrase grinds my gears, like salts my apples? Oh, yeah, see, this guy gets it. That's how you play. That really censor. <laughs> Um, that really censor. <laughs> that really censors my hentai. <laughs> Let me write you some personalized haikus. I just subscribed. Hello, new best friend. Please enjoy your stay right here. Don't you ever leave. Rules for the drinking game of Game of Thrones. So without further ado, here's how you play the drinking game of thrones. Take a shot every time you forget a name. Oh, that's that's cruel, man. There's like 80 main characters. Come on. You know the guy with the, with the sword? What's his name? Sword boy. Write an original anime theme song. One word at a time. A parent's boy with an oversized sword. Running and fighting will destiny. Design a brand new movie poster for the film Captain America Civil War. Christ, this this one's a train wreck. Civil Express. <laughs> Look how tenderly they're looking into each other's eyes. Describe Hollywood in just four words. Reboot, remake, prequel, sequel. What are some tips on being a good mother? I have a good tip for your mother. What makes you happy in just four words? Test came back negative. Fill in the blanks. I love you like blank loves blank. I love you like Jack loves other guys. Look me in the eye, you know that we're Describe your morning in just four words. Gotta find the bleach. Design a brand new t-shirt. My parents are getting a divorce. <laughs> Redesign the icon for uh, YouTube. And I gotta say, it looks pretty good in gold, but uh, let's see what you guys came up with, you know what I mean? Really? Y you too. <laughs> Describe America in just four words. Forgot to vote, lol. Where is the worst place to play Pokemon Go? At the hospital, while your wife is giving birth. Please be real, please be real, please be real. Yes! Create a brand new website or app. An app that makes better yai questions. Okay, hater, whatever. I don't need an app to make yai questions. This is how I do it. Sunday, go away. Oh, hell yes. Roses are red four. Thanks, banana grams. Alternate meanings behind the acronym KYS. Keep yourself sterile. Design a new anime character so that I could try and draw him or her or it. Anime Aaron. All right, now this was a fun challenge. Here's the very flattering picture I used as a base model. And here's the new and improved anime version of her. Um, please notice the um, bead of sweat from her forehead as she is gasping nervously. Let me fix your country's flags. Fix the Vatican flag. All right, well, I don't want to get in too much trouble here. And honestly, it's, it's, it's a very beautiful, simplistic flag, you know? But what I would like to do is um, I want to add the Pope. Just kind of have him uh, peek around, peek around the corner, you know? He's like, I'm, I'm going to get you. Uh, and then we're going to take this beautiful picture of my arm and kind of move it here so it looks like he's just sort of peeking around the corner, you know? He's just, he's just always watching, you know? He's always he's always watching. He's the Pope. Boom, fix your flag. Describe your ex in just four words. Licked my braces twice. <laughs> Make a new flag for the Olympics. If you liked it, then you should have put a Sonic on it, bitch. <laughs> you just got sonic Make up a new sport for the Olympic Games. All the, <laughs> all the same sports but everyone has to compete in first. <laughs> Kids bopify it. What does that mean? Well, a while ago, I tweeted out some lyrics to popular songs, and I asked you guys to take those lyrics and kids bopify them, or make them nice and family friendly. Give me a second. I need to get my story straight. 
My friends are in the bathroom getting higher than the Empire State. How did you kids bopify this? My friends are eating cookies, getting sugar rush and tummy aches. <laughs> that one hurt a bit to say. How to get ready for a first date. Crank the beauty filter right up to eight. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. So natural. Disappoint your parents in just four words. It's just for cosplay. <laughs> Best roses are red, violets are blue poems. Again, th this is the fourth time we've done this. But this time, it's different. This time, I'm wearing a suit. Roses are red. Houston's in Texas. This string cheese packaging is oddly sexist. <laughs> Thanks, HuffPo. Describe the new iPhone 7, but in just four words, so keep it brief. Where are my AirBuds? Let me fix your Twitter bios. Fix my bio, please. All right, yours says, single music is life 18. This is another one where you really need commas. I know you're trying to say single, comma, music is life, comma, 18, but instead it comes off as the next album in the, now that's what I call music series. Single music is life 18. <laughs> So keep the bio, just change the avatar. When is the worst time to say you too to somebody? I think your sister's hot. You too? <laughs> Win says, when is something no longer cool? When Weird Al parodies it, and when Family Guy makes fun of it. See, that I agree with, the Family Guy one. Remember that episode where Brian dances to peanut butter jelly time for like 30 seconds? And that's it, that's the joke, there's no context. It's not really satire, it's, it's just doing a meme on Family Guy, and that was the bit that still grinds my gears. What will be the most popular trends of the year 2020? Dankalicious dance moves like clop and dunk. Do the clop, and then dunk, and then clop, clop, and wow, the future sounds like shit. How would you break up with your SO if you found someone else? Hey bud. Ooh, bud zoned, woof. Come up with new campaign slogans for both Trump and Hillary. I have Casey Neistat's vote. <laughs> what is the sluttiest thing you've done today? My pants are showing my ankles. Great, thanks. Now I have to demonetize the video because of, of this filth. Top 20 achievements of humanity. We had a good run. Fundies, yes. For those who don't know, Fundies is underwear built for two. Makes a great gift for a friend. Thanks, Dad. How do you plan on spending your election night? Drunk, ooh, what kind of drunk are we talking? Wine drunk? Whiskey drunk? Tequila drunk? Vodka drunk? Nah, you wanna get beer drunk, don't ya? Oh, you little minx. Design the new Starbucks holiday cup. <laughs> that was a really cool design. <laughs> Fix my Twitter bio. It helps to know that my current bio now reads, books are for libraries, am I right? Business inquiries and then an email. So with that in mind, Smurfs are for Smurfs, Smurf for Durf, Smurfs and Smurfery. <laughs> Come up with the exact opposite of grinds my gears. That really OMGs my who did this. <laughs> fix 2016. Just fix it, fix all of it, it's a mess. By fixing its Twitter bio, ooh, I wonder what the Twitter bio of 2016 would be. How about the George R.R. R. Martin of years? Or maybe one of those cliche, if you can't handle me at my worst, blah, blah, blah. Get it, because 2016 is a crazy bitch. Design the official flag of Christmas. Somebody once showed me some flags that were Nepali. Predictions for the year 2017. Season two of 2016. <laughs> Dear God, oh, I'm, I'm gonna fucking kill you guys. Who wants to get skinned first? 300, 300. To come up with more verses for Alexander Hamilton too. What's he do at Christmas time? Alexander Carolyn. Yesterday, I asked you for your worst Christmas gift. You see, I'm on this quest to find just the worst Christmas gift given this year, and I think I found it. An advent calendar. Why? Poor guy won't even use it until December 1st of 2017. What a terrible Christmas gift. Well done. Well done. Come up with an alternative to who did this, to steal memes and such. Credit to the original owner. That's my favorite, so lazy. Okay, Google, where is Jesus? Take boring, everyday situations and turn them into buzzy, clickbaity YouTube video titles. For example, I had Chinese food. So what would that look like as a YouTube video title? I'm guilty of cultural appropriation. My apology. <laughs> Here's what the thumbnail for that would look like. Come up with some fake facts. Now these are facts that sound real, but totally aren't. Now what I've done is that I've taken some of your best fake facts and photoshopped them into a 
shareable image that you can post on Facebook and Twitter to really mess with your relatives. The sun is a sun, not a star. <laughs> Here you go, here's my memeified version of that. This is going to confuse everyone you know. What should Trump's first official act as president be? I don't care, I live in Canada. You idiot, you're gonna get affected too. First thing Trump's gonna do is rename Canada to North Mexico. Is that what you want? What else could NSFW stand for? We all know it means not safe for work, but I wanna know what else it could mean. Mm, consider my nipples stiff for winter. <laughs> Best anime inspired creations. And you know what? Let's just get started right now. YouTuber Divinity uploaded a video and here's a snippet. <laughs> Doesn't sound like much, right? Just a MIDI recreation of the Naruto theme song. No, no, it is so much more than that. You see the video is titled, How to Make a Track Out of Jack's Voice, and everything you hear <laughs> consists entirely of my voice. That's melody, harmony, snare, bass. Now you might be thinking, what? That doesn't make sense. It doesn't sound like your voice at all. Here's how they did it. Yesterday, 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 Four words. Remove top 10 videos. Oh no, but then you would lose all of these classics. In percentages, what makes you, you? 26% body fat, 74% also body fat. That's, that's good. Design Valentine's Day cards. Let me eat, <laughs> let me eat your lasagna. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> How to spend Valentine's Day if you're single? Stocking nexus, playing for honor, spending the evening with Rosie Palmer. Boring, mild challenges. Text horizontally. What a wonderfully mild idea. Yo, what up fam? It's your boy Two Hats, and today I'm gonna do the text horizontally challenge. Haha, <laughs> oh my god, it feels so weird and wonky. Haha, <laughs> please subscribe. Come up with some fake news. So what I've done is I've taken some of your best answers and photoshopped them into BuzzFeed and BBC articles. Pluto is a planet again. Per perfect fake news. Yes, people would fall for that. So let's make it look official. Pluto reclassified as a planet, says NASA. Written by Portrick Manpower. Have fun and go wild. I, I tweeted out some pictures of me holding up a blank sheet of paper and I let you guys do whatever you wanted to them. Great, now I look like a freaking idiot. Thanks. Thanks for that, guys. Nice. Fill in the blanks. A group of blank is called a blank. A group of Canadians is called an apology. That's right. What is the quickest way to piss off a nerd? For example, calling Link Zelda, or calling the doctor, Doctor Who, etc, etc. My favorite console, ha <laughs> ha! My favorite console is mobile. <laughs> Mimi, big boy, Mimi, big boy. Mimi, big boy. Mimi, big boy. Hey, JSOS, Jack here. The flag of Nepal is as beautiful as it is unique. Its very design is steeped in mathematics. But what if Nepal's flag were more flag-shaped? You know, like a regular flag. Make Nepal's flag more flag-shaped. Well, look at that. If you tape a couple of Nepali flags together, you get a perfect rectangle. Help me write a rap song or whatever, but it's gonna have to wait because Eminem just leaked his newest track and it is fire. It is straight up fire. Take a listen. My name is Eminem and I'm here to say If a bully bullies you, then get away. Fill in the blank. Blank, lied the YouTuber. Oh, this'll be a regular thing. Come up with new abbreviations and acronyms. This genius turned finna nut into an acronym. Frick, I need nutting immediately. Now, uh, thanks dad. Come up with new Harry Potter titles. And I've asked my friend Weevil to help illustrate some of your ideas, and uh, he did marvelously. 
Harry Potter and the Chamber of Weed. <laughs> Let me write you all some personalized, custom-made haikus. I just lost a bet over who can get a girlfriend first. I'm a loser. Please make me feel better. I'll try. You'll find one someday. Just have patience, take your time. Or die a virgin. It's your choice, buddy. It's your choice. Fill in the blank. Wanna feel old? Blank. Wanna feel old? The Kids Bop Kids are 52 now. Wow. They still perform though, which is like really sad. If we could make every comment the same. For a while, it looked hopeless. And I was beginning to lose hope. 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 But then, a Christmas miracle happened. Mimi, big disappointment. Mimi, big disappointment. Mimi, big disappointment! Somehow, the internet rallied together and everyone was posting Mimi, big disappointment. Every single comment, without exception, all 38,000. It's the comeback story they'll be talking about for years. They said it couldn't be done, but we done did it, squad fam. This is the moment where you realize anything and everything is possible. Don't ever let some hater tell you that it can't be done, because we did it. You want to ask that girl out, but she's way out of your league because you ugly AF? Do it! You want to start a popular Let's Play channel, even though the market is oversaturated? Do it! Send this video to someone you love, then send it to someone you hate! This is it, you guys. This is my FouseyTube moment. What are some events we can count down to? I'm gonna litter the screen with countdowns and, and then fry my computer. Let's go. Countdown till Donald Trump finishes presidency. So what I've done here is, well, you need two countdowns. Um, one for the first term and another and just in case he gets elected for a second term. You gotta be prepared. More fake facts, baby! Squad fam, last time we did this, we bamboozled so many people, but guess what? I think we can bamboozle even more. All people are born with brown eyes, but the melanin in our systems make them look different colors and shades. Shit, halfway through reading that, I was starting to believe it. I really didn't have to change much at all to, to make this sound official, so good on you. Also, bonus points for using the word melanin. Terrible, cringy fan base names that we could come up with. Top of the morning to you, nobodies. <laughs> Wedding hashtags for Aaron and myself. Our wedding's not until next year, but it's never too early. Yo, smash that bride button, fam. <laughs> what do you think the plot to Shrek 5 is? Fiona comes out as bisexual. How proud were you when you came up with that pun? I hope it's very. When is the worst time to say I love you? When wrestling. <laughs> nah, I think it just makes it more interesting, really. Fix my forehead. It's long overdue. Come on, guys, help me out. Oh, no. Oh, absolutely not. Absolutely not. No, no, no. That's... No, you gave me more forehead. How did you do that? What is something you wish your smartphone could do? Take a selfie of me taking a selfie of my selfie. Sadly, there would be a market for that. New group poses for photos, since it is con season after all, what with E3 and Comic Con and Big Con coming up soon, you need some new group poses. And for this video, I asked Erin to help me out. She did okay. A dab, but by someone who has no idea what a dab is. So just dab wrong, so like, do that. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Give me two random topics, and I would try to link them using nothing but the suggested videos in YouTube. You know, those things off the side if you're in desktop mode, or under the video if you're on mobile. We're gonna connect Beethoven's fifth to Mimi Big Boy. And I am proud to say I did it. Let's go. So first we'll start off with and then from there we go to a Chopin and then from there we go to another pianist and from there we go to Moana. From Moana we go to a cute cover of another Disney song and from there we go to Under the Sea and then from there we go to Mulan and from there we go to Lava. Remember that little short uh, before Frozen? And here's the key, from there we go to a song from the Lorax movie. Now, I don't know if you're caught up with your memes, but the Lorax got memed to death with shit posts. And I'm gonna use that to my advantage. So from there, we get to the entire movie, but every time they say tree, the video speeds up. And then an emoji movie shit post. 
and then another Emoji Movie ship post, and another, and another, and another, and then finally something tying the Emoji Movie with fidget spinners. And then from there we enter fidget spinner hell. Melts in your hand, DIY gallium fidget spinner. Most unique fidget spinners. Coolest fidget spinners. Fidget spinner versus fidget spinner. Metal fidget spinner. It's this endless wave of fidget spinner videos, and I'm just looking for mine and suggesting, because I know eventually we're gonna get to one of my fidget spinner videos. But finally, the light at the end of the tunnel. Look at that peeking out from the suggested videos. Oh, that's me. Click on that, boom. Takes me to rest in peace fidget spinners. Takes me to the please don't Photoshop this guy, which takes me to the Mimi big boy guy, which then finally takes me to the origin video of Mimi big boy, where it all started, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you can waste hours and hours of your free time. What does E3 stand for? Eating earwax. Excellent. <laughs> ah. What is Mario's signature catchphrase? I got the one I like under my comment. How wasn't I a feature? <laughs> yeah, he says that all the time. What's another name we can call YouTubers or content creators or influencers, whatever. What's a new label? for all of that. Camera talkers. So true it hurts. Your best roses are red poems. This is something I've never ever asked before. We're, we're breaking new ground. Roses are red, violets are blue. Your mom's hot, does she have a snap? <laughs> well played. Make compliment chains in the YouTube comment section. Would people would start replying to each other complimenting the person above them. Not everyone was on board the compliment chain. Someone just posted, no. Nice Spanish. <laughs> I bet Kay feels like a real jerk now. Summarize Game of Thrones, all of it, in just one sentence for all the newcomers. My mom said I'm not allowed to watch it. <laughs> if you were a scented candle, what would your scent be? Here's Manly Tears, uh, way to use the uh, screen cap of me crying after I looked at pictures of dead dogs. That's my secret, by the way. How do you stay safe from hackers? I bathe my computer once a week to keep my files clean. Thank you once again for your contribution, Dolan Dark. Can always count on you. Describe millennials in just four words. Wait, that's not Harry Potter? What offends you the most? Ooh, okay, this, this one actually does offend me. Like what, my country's not good enough? Come on. Ooh, 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 How should I celebrate this momentous occasion? Disappoint your parents. Ah, uh, I don't need three mil for that. <laughs> What's your billion dollar movie pitches? Jigsaw movie. You know, they're actually making a jigsaw movie later this year, so that, it, that's a good idea. Where the jigsaw pieces have feelings and that one piece that needs to find where it fits. I hate you. I hate you. What do you do when you dab on your haters, but then your haters dab back? Up the ante with the eternal dab. They'll never see it coming. You wanna talk about an infinite loop of dabbing? Well, here it is. I'm a little mesmerized by this. I don't, I don't want it to end. What is your biggest regret? This is, this is just a picture of your wedding. Wow. Way to commit. Give me names for my compliment track. Boogie had a life-changing surgery. In a year or two, he's gonna weigh a third of me. Totally legit British slang. Uh, Aaron and I will be traveling to London for a few days, and I want to blend in with the locals. Instead of hot dogs, they're called Rupert's Fingers. <laughs> in just four words, can you save the world? U.S. drinking age, 18. That, that'll either fix some problems or cause brand new ones. Make me a thumbnail for this video. This one. <laughs> I really, really wanted to call today's video YouTube's deleting thumbnails <laughs> and uses this, but people will get so pissed off when they realize, nah, it's just another Yai episode. <laughs> what are your predictions for the new iPhone? You can now plug in even more dongles. Okay, see this, this is nice. What's your fetish? Come on, don't be shy. Nothing's taboo. Just lay it all out on the table. Getting likes on YouTube. Was it good? Fake movie quotes that include the title of the movie. 
And yes, this question is terribly convoluted and confusing, but somehow you all pulled through. What kind of war is this, Luke Skywalker? It's a Star Wars. <laughs> Invent a new holiday. Christmas 2, the squeakquel. I don't know what that would entail, and I don't care. Let's make it real. Let me fix your life. Give me your life problems, and I will try to fix you. Coldplay. I'm gay for my friend, but my friend is straight for her boyfriend. Well, the way I see it, you have two options. You can either respect their relationship, or you can wreck that ship. What's the most basic thing you've ever done? Went to a high school football game and hated it. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> what word or phrase do you say when you get pissed off? <laughs> Zoinks. <laughs> Spook me up for October. It's an annual tradition and I will present to you my top 31 picks. One for every day of October. And just for reference, here's the original pick before we dive straight into hell. The, the thing that intrigues me the most about this one is that the tweet says, always a pleasure. <laughs> Don't know what that means. Come up with more fake news. It is believed that horses will have gone extinct by the year 2057. Perfect. Crisis, we are running out of horses. Due to rapidly falling populations and gross malnourishment, horses are quickly becoming an endangered species and could go extinct as early as 2057. Ugh, oh, that was such a good idea. Well done, you. This urgent article was written by Gravy Boat. What do you need? to start a YouTube channel. Make YouTube videos in 2009. That will hugely help. <laughs> the truth hurts. What will the top costumes be for Halloween this year? Oh God, you even, you even put little gloves on and everything. I look like the mascot that greets people into my own theme park. If you could time travel, where and when would you go and how would you mess with it? I travel to my own funeral, say I'm late and climb into the coffin. That would mess some people up. What's the point? The point of waking up is to fall asleep again. Now that's a spicy meatabala. Who should you avoid on Twitter? Avoid flat earth or furries? No, I disagree. If you can find me a flat earth or furry, that's kind of dope. <laughs> Hi, I'm Wiggles the Fox and I believe earth is a disc. <laughs> Last minute costume ideas for Halloween. Garbage, because you don't need anything extra. That one hurts. Make me some terrible, awful, no good, very bad video intros. You know what I need? I need some good old fashioned cringe. Mess me up. Mimi Big Boy. Mimi Big Boy. Mimi Big Boy. Mimi Big Boy. Ooh, that's good. What is the best way? to get a party started. I just want to let everyone here know that I've been a vegan for about five days now and it feels great. It's better for the environment, it's better for your body. Wait, where are you going? Help me write a song. I am a rebel, I never rhyme. Halloween is over, now it's Christmas time. Describe YouTubers in just four words. Some funny, some Jax films. <laughs> Zoinks. What do you think will be in this year's YouTube Rewind? Only late show hosts, no one else. Jimmy Fallon always was my favorite YouTuber. Can you describe yourself using only emojis? Mm, I think this one means you're a giant nerd. The hell out of here, jocks only. Let me fix even more of your sad little lives. Jack, my bangs ate my eyes. Please help, you poor thing. Oh, let's take a look. Don't worry, I know exactly what you need. First up, we're gonna lift those bangs to reveal those beautiful peepers you got there. Let your inner light shine through. And uh, you know what? Uh, let's, let's go ahead and put those bangs back uh, where they belong. I guess I can't fix everything. What are you thankful for? Hey, I'm thankful for marrying my daughter, Yeehaw! <laughs> you just got a book deal. What is your book about? The Emoji Book, where all of the text is emojis, and apparently you've got a bestseller on your hands. Good job. Who should Time Magazine's Person of the Year be? <coughs> Christ, guys, that's really not cool. Not funny. <coughs> Christmas me up for December. All I want for Christmas is for this image to be permanently etched in your brain. What do you do to get into the Christmas spirit? Ah, destroy Dick December, the mischievous brother to No Nut November. What are some quotes and lines that you think 
will be in the upcoming Avengers Infinity War movie. One, two, three, four. I declare Infinity War. <laughs> what do you want for Christmas? A new Tony Hawk game. That's not funny, that's too real. I really want that. This is no longer a joke episode. What does the FCC even stand for? Fidget spinners, cool toys, Christmas. This is from a video of FCC chairman Ajit Pai trying his absolute best to look relatable and hip. To me, this is the absolute epitome of how do you do fellow kids. I cannot find a clearer example of this meme. Fix our wedding site, a, a pretty tall order. This site features a gif of famous movie wedding scenes. Let me see if I can guess which movies these are all from. That's The Godfather. That's Godfather Part 2. That's Godfather 3. That one's Godfather 4, A New Hope. That one's Godfather 5 and The Prisoner of Azkaban. Uh, I don't know this one. Uh, pass. When did you stop believing in Santa? Uh, last I checked, Tim Allen is still alive. Cool, remember that time Tim Allen killed a guy? Why was everyone so cool to let that slide? What's your fursona? Ah, Tony the Tiger. So I included this one because you can't talk about Tony the Tiger without discussing the saga where whenever the Tony the Tiger Twitter account would post something, a lot of people would respond with terrible, terrible smut. And it got so bad that the actual Tony the Tiger Twitter account had to post begging people to stop sending him smut. <laughs> Let's keep things great and family friendly. <laughs> and with one post, Tony the Tiger ended furry fetishism. Psych! Let me fix your art. Now here is a lovely portrait from a Slim Kim on Twitter. And we really should take time to appreciate the artwork in this piece. Now the first thing you'll notice is she has no eyes. That's, that's problematic. Let's give her some little peepers. Boop. Boop. <laughs> Next up we're gonna put some lipstick right on her lips. Pucker up, buttercup. <laughs> oh, where'd her mouth go? <laughs> Don't worry guys, I, I got it. It's right here. Yeah. <laughs> but wait a tick. Where's your shirt? Why aren't you wearing a shirt? You gotta put a shirt on, dude. Come on. I got a hot shirt for you, though. Like, really hot shirt. <laughs> You're gonna love this shirt. Hold on. You're gonna love your shirt because your shirt is a Mimi Big Boy shirt. <laughs> oh my god. How cool is that? <laughs> Wait a minute. We need to give you a little arm. <laughs> That's right, fellas. She's got all four of her fingers. <laughs> <laughs> hey, oh man, yep, fixed your art. What was the worst gift you got for Christmas this year? A collection of face cut out photo props. What, what demographic could that possibly be for? In a world of Snapchat filters, etc., etc., why? New Year's resolutions for 2018. I'll stop watching your pintless videos, Jack. Okay, from now on, I vow to include more pints in all of my videos. Please rate my puns micro-cheating. It's the hot new buzzword that dozens of blogs are talking about. But what exactly is it? Define micro-cheating. When your dad kisses you goodnight. <laughs> I had to read this one out loud about 40 times before I stopped laughing. Such a wonderful image. What does BTS stand for? Hey, look, it's that big torso schmuck. <laughs> The one that all those kids are memeing. What should I do if I win YouTuber of the year? I will walk up to the podium and give a speech while wearing a fursuit. This is the only way I see it happening. I'll bring a little duffel bag with me containing a fursuit, which I will then put on if and only if they announce my name at the Shorty Awards. And I'll give a very straight-laced speech. I'll never even address the fursuit. What the title of the next Star Wars movie is, and I got so many good answers, one of them's bound to be right. Oh, the swimsuit episode. See, I would, I would watch that in a heartbeat. Don't tell me you wouldn't. Let me write you some very sensual haikus. You give me a topic, and I do the rest. <laughs> Make a haiku about the US education system. What is a haiku? No, what, what's a haiku? We didn't, we didn't learn this in school. What's a, what, what is it? Come up with some cool ass Valentine's Day cards. You're a real boss, baby. <laughs> this card is almost perfect. It's, it's just missing one little, one little detail. There it is. Much better. What does finna woke mean? 
Finna woke me up, woke me up and I can't woke up, woke me up and save me. Sorry, did you just make an Evanescence joke in the year of our Lord 2018? That's been awoke. Come up with new, better Winter Olympic sports. How about a snowball fight with stones inside? That's awful. No. Write our wedding vows. Uh-oh. I vow to not have a mustache. Wait, I'm, I'm sorry. I think that one's yours, my bad. Well, I thought it was funny. Oh, don't. Uh, she's gone. Worth it! Fake Facts 3, Fake Facts 3 Put your hands together for some Fake Facts 3 They're here for you and they're here for me Put your hands together for some Fake Facts 3 Yes, I have photoshopped a bunch of your Fake Facts But to spice things up a little I've also photoshopped some fictional watermarks to throw on them Like Brain Shock, Buzz Facts, or Fact Snacks Clapping after a movie is illegal in Switzerland as it should be. Let me make a couple of adjustments. We're almost there. A 2016 law in Florida forbids clapping at the end of a movie. Simply applauding a film could land you a hundred dollar fine. This is one of those rare fake facts that I really want to be true. Yesterday, I asked you, what should I ask Alexa? Alexa, why are frogs turning gay? I'm still learning how to answer frog questions. <laughs> Try asking Tommy a frog fact for trivia. I'm still learning frog questions. Ah, that explains it. She hasn't been programmed for frog questions yet. Describe Twitch in just four words. Tubers ruin more sites. Hi. A few days ago, we all came up with a bunch of lovely fake facts three. But who did we bamboozle? Did we fool anyone? And the answer is, Yes. Remember that fake fact about how 65% of Gen Zers don't know how to ride a bicycle? I love the response this got, you fucking kids, um, because it's from the person's mom. Wow. Let me fix your terrible, cringy usernames. Ber Berks Berkstagen is my go-to username. Why? Let's change it to for vowels, since you apparently hate vowels so much. If you could chat with anyone, living, dead, fictional, who would it be and why? I would want to talk to Al Pacino, great actor, to ask him why he decided to star in Jack and Jill. Hey, a paycheck's a paycheck. What is your underdog story? When my mom told me I couldn't buy a $70 Yu-Gi-Oh figurine, but I believed in the heart of her credit card and bought it anyways. I hope that mom's watching. How should I hide my bulging, bulbous forehead? I really need your help. I'm ashamed of it. I'm embarrassed by it. How do I hide this hideous thing? Don't even bother. It's still going. And if this gif looks familiar to you, it's because it's by the same genius that made this gift from last year's forehead related yai. Who would win in a fight? Superman, Wonder Woman, or Batman? Uh, Batman, obviously, because he's made of bats, right? I don't I don't think, I don't think that's right. We do not grant anyone permission to alter the photograph. And if you did, uh, see you in court. The trouble all started when Alice on Twitter uploaded this highly disrespectful Photoshop. And while it is impressive on a technical level, I would still like it deleted immediately. Thanks so much for giving us br brother and sister tattoos. <laughs> no one asked for this. You're all sick. Where should we go for our honeymoon? A job fair. So it's gonna be like that, huh? How do I stop these tears? Tiny corks. Just to plug the ducks. Give me infinity war in just four words. Barney sacrifices baby bop. Wow. This picture is scarily accurate. What's the worst thing you've ever done? I made 42 dummy accounts to like my own comments. Wow. You should be ashamed and a little proud, mostly ashamed. Can you Shrek it? Can you take any subject matter, anything at all, and relate it back to Shrek in just a few steps? 50 Shades of Grey. All right, I gotta admit, this was by far the toughest one. This was a real pain in the butt, but I did it anyway. 50 Shades of Grey stars Dakota Johnson, who also appears in the movie The Social Network, starring Jesse Eisenberg, who also appears in the movie Justice League, which stars Ben Affleck. Ben Affleck also stars in The Town, which also features John Hamm. John Hamm voices an ogre in Shrek Forever After. Avatars 
are a lot like snowflakes. No two profile pics are the same. Just kidding, 90% of them are anime or BTS. Let me fix your dumb, bad avatars. Michael on Twitter asks, what's a avatar? Uh, this Michael, that, that's an avatar and that's your avatar. And if, if you ask me, quite frankly, it's far too close. We're gonna have to zoom out a bit. Maybe you're a close talker, that's fine. So let's take your face and zoom out and we're going to seamlessly blend these two photos. Oh, that looks really good already. So we're gonna press the blend button. There it is, there's your handsome new uh, avatar, big boy. Go get him, you lady killer. What will the title be for the next Avengers movie? Like, what are they gonna call the Avengers Infinity War 2? Avengers Forever After, the best pun. So they're making four more avatar movies. That's not a joke, that's a real thing that's happening. Can you name just three characters from the first Avatar film. Just three. Xena, Chewbacca, and Steve. <laughs> Avatar is just such a memorable franchise. Can you guess the movie in just four words? I desire the precious. Okay, you cheated. You can't use the name of the movie title in your clue, all right? That's cheating. How can I become a better gamer? Mountain Dew usually helps me. Yeah, me too. Where's the worst place to teleport? Berkeley Springs annual water tasting competition. N now I'm curious. Please, oh please, don't Photoshop our beautiful, lovely honeymoon, specifically this photo. Just don't do it. <laughs> Alexander, 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 Alexander. Now he's wearing black and white. Alexander Paniskin. What does IHOP actually mean? We all know that IHOP has temporarily changed its name to International House of Burgers, but I think we can do better. IHOP no social life. <laughs> Who was your first crush? Velma, but without her glasses. A very specific fetish. What would a Jack Con consist of? Protesters mad because their post got 16 likes and they weren't featured on yay. Of course, I, I should have known. Just an angry mob of, of people with like 400 likes. What does be a Klondike even mean? Proving there's nothing that a hundred men or more could ever do. Written by Africa by Toto only. <laughs> that never not makes me laugh. Help me give Magic the Gathering cards better names and, and better rules. Supreme exemplar, oh God. Oh God, look at this thing. This abomination looks like it's in pain. We're gonna call it God's Mistake. I feel like that's just a much more accurate name for this beast. What's your podcast about? I wanna listen to it. Uh, it's about why podcasts suck. Listen to music, dickheads. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible Patreon rewards, wow. Ooh, a 10 minute apology video, yes. I'd do that for free. Oh look, you even made a fake Patreon page. Jack Douglas is creating daily vlogs and food reviews. Hell yeah, he is. New Yai outros. The real Soli G recreated the Yai outro using nothing but automatones. What are automatones? I'm so glad you asked. And it's not just the music either. You did a frame by frame recreation of Everything. Do not think this went unseen by me. I loved it. In just four words, what does every man or woman want to hear during sex? <laughs> Misa Jar Jar Binks! <laughs> oh look, there's a translate button. Let's, could not trans, all right, thanks. Let me fix your art, too. Oh God, this guy's back. This is the same guy who did that atrocious forehead portrait. Couple of problems here. Um, the mouth is a little too big, so we're gonna um, uh, smallify it. First, we're gonna get rid of that ghastly tongue. It's too much tongue. We're gonna fix that mouth, boy. Cool. By the way, nobody has that many eyes. I'm sorry. There you go. And you know what? Let's have him say something cool. God, what's that thing I always say? Parents rule. That's why they pay me the big bucks. What would your supervillain name be? 
And what would your evil superpower be? Name, movie trailer, power, number one trending, always. Why oh why are these precious little doggos fighting? They're fighting over who gets to play with that knife on the floor. Oh yeah, I forgot I left that knife on the floor. May the best doggo win. 11 years ago, I uploaded a video called Give This Song a Title, where I play an original composition in glorious 240p. And for over a decade, you've provided countless titles for this nameless song. But now, it is time to officially christen it with a real name. Give this song a title. Not every question I ask you gets made into a yai. And there's a couple of reasons for this. That's why today's video is all about the rejected questions and your equally rejected answers. Ooh, E3 predictions. Yes, right on time. E3 is only uh, 10 months away. I, I really timed this one well. Alexander Hamilton, the Telltale series. If you had the power to spy on anyone or anything, how would you use this power? I would spy on Jack's Films giveaway and see why they're so generously doing so many giveaways. Wait, what are you, oh God. Ah, yuck. That's totally me though. What are you super duper sorry for? I'm sorry for faking my death. For a notably sweet reaction video, it got number three on trending, so uh, very worth it. Describe Los Angeles in just four words. <laughs> Whoa! The only Californian city, that's true. What is my big fat announcement? What's this secret project I've been hinting at for the better part of a month. You're only gonna pick yai answers from verified YouTubers from now on. Absolutely, you must have that check. Fill in the blank. I'm a 90s kid and I love blank. I'm a 90s kid and I love that people bought all those Beanie Babies thinking they were good future investments. Yep, count me in. In just four words, describe the perfect viral video. Oof, slime Fortnite kissing challenge. I hated every word in that sentence. Help me kids bopify it once more. It has been over two years since we last did this. A song from Post Malone's Beer Bongs and Bentleys has this lyric, drinking Henny and I'm trying to forget, but I can't get this shit out of my head. How would Kids Bop change that lyric? Drinking milk and I'm trying to grow, but I can't get past that fo fo fo. Describe the new iPhone in just four words. Can't afford. Buys anyway. Fill in the blank. I hate when YouTubers blank. I hate when YouTubers depend on their comment section for 90% of their content. Not true, not true. I did the math and it's only 73% of my videos. The math checks out, it's sound. Good try, Satan. How would you use a big ass wide ass monitor. I would use it to see them big cheeks getting clapped. Woo! You filthy slut. So on one hand, you have a thousand dollar emoji machine, but on the other hand, you get a thousand dollar Fortnite skin. What's better, iPhones or Android phones and why? Tell me, let's end this. Android, cause I can use my note phones to light the fireplace. Sum up your entire personality in just four measly tiny little words. I'm like super quirky. <laughs> that one hurt to read. Spook me up for October. Really? Here's the template I gave you all for this year. Finger gunning Spider-Man 3. <laughs> the world will never forget. I don't care how good the MCU Spider-Man is. There is only one emo Spider-Man. <laughs> Clickbait some really boring mundane sentences. I took my dog to the vet. What could you possibly, how would you clickbait that? My dog died. No ads. <laughs> Describe your Halloween costume this year, but in just four words, an apology video. Think about it, you get a big poster board um, and you cut out a hole for your face. Poster board looks like a YouTube video that's 40 minutes long with 20 ad breaks. The title is, I'm super duper sorry. 3,000 likes, 45,000 dislikes. The downside of this costume is you have to pretend to cry the entire night or whatever party you end up going to, but oh my God, would that be worth it? Tips on living a healthier lifestyle. Work out by doing... <laughs> Look, I'm not mad, I'm just disappointed in all of you. What are some new categories for a web awards type show. <laughs> hardest, 
Hardest flex on a seven-year-old. I don't know why, that makes me laugh every time. Hey kid, check out my Rolex. What are your best tips on becoming an influencer? Watch animal videos dubbed with your voice. It, a la Bob Saget's America's Funniest Home Videos. I don't know why I left this one in, now I'm just confused and mad. <laughs> Let me fix your problems. Again! Jennifer on Twitter has a very interesting problem. I'm going to be alone with no date as the maid of honor and bridesmaid at two different weddings. Jennifer, have you never seen a rom-com before? Because let me tell you what's gonna happen. In the first wedding you go to, you're going to be smitten by some beautiful single stranger and you're gonna have a, an enchanting evening. The second wedding you go to, you're gonna meet another equally stunning stranger and have a lovely time with that person and then after the two weddings you'll have to whimsically choose betwixt the two strangers that's not a problem that has been the plot of every rom-com for decades in 2016 i hunted down the worst christmas gift you guys got in 2017 i also same thing did the same thing but it's 28 well it's 2019 but it was Help me find the worst Christmas gift of 2018. Monopoly for millennials. Now, Tori on Twitter was kind enough to provide a plethora of screenshots. Let's really drink in the box art here. Uh, apparently, millennials hate cows. He's wearing glasses that I've never seen a single millennial wear at all. Forget real estate. You can't afford it anyway. What a savage joke, Monopoly man. I do like his coffee though, cause millennials always be drinking, am I right? Here's what the custom pieces look like, including a hashtag. We do love our hashtags, don't we? Uh, there's a camera, but nope, nope, we, nobody uses those anymore. And of course, a crying laughing emoji. I just feel broken inside. Here's the Monopoly man taking a selfie, because God is left. Artisanal coffee, artisanal, artisanal? I don't care, I'm just mad. Don't forget avocados, because millennials love avocados. And apparently we're all vegan too. I, is that a cliche? Is that like, is that like a thing tied in with, with millennials? What's your TED talk about? What it's like being addicted to chungus. <laughs> you. Why oh why should you go vegan? You should go vegan so you can flex on those vegetarians. <laughs> As we all know, a vegan is an ascended vegetarian or vegetarian level two. Who do you think is gonna be the next playable fighter in Smash Bros? Eric Andre, yes, he comes in and just destroys the stage. Great choice. Why are you subscribed to me? I'm subscribed for a head. <laughs> a forehead joke that isn't garbage. Me likey, help me design an official international flag for all of us gamers. Oh my God, yes, the collage of all the bad gamer shirts. Which of these would I wear in public? Ooh, definitely the I don't work out, I level up shirt. Hell yeah. Relationship status, single taken gamer. <laughs> yes, yes. Let me fix your Tinder profiles. We're all looking for love. So let me play Cupid and hook you up. Connor, your bio reads, must have daddy issues and be able to crush a watermelon between your thighs. All right, Mr. Edgelord, you thought you could be all funny and edgy on my channel? Big mistake. It's time to punish you. So we're gonna turn you into an anti-vaxxer? <laughs> hey, that's what you get, dude. Mess with the bull, get the horns. Proud anti-vaxxer and firm believer of essential oils. Good luck getting girls now, dude. Let me edit your videos. Let me be your personal video editor, since that is literally all I know. The dank potato with your video titled, How to Be a Successful Rapper. So first things first, I do like the aesthetic of the fireplace behind you, that's cute. However, I was disappointed because you just kind of ramble on for three minutes. Step two, drugs. And I really wanted to hear a rap. If a video is titled, How to Be a Successful Rapper, I kind of expect that whole video to be in a rap. Luckily, I had some free time, so I figured, what the heck, I'll just, uh, I'll just, uh, write my own rap and, uh, put it in your mouth. Sound good? 
Haha, I wanna rap today. I'ma show you how to do it, take potato away. Follow my lead, here's the main takeaway. Three itty bitty steps, then I fade away. Step one, put a lit fire behind you. It looks it looks very cool. Step two, try to find words that rhyme like potato and baked potato. Step three, upload your song to the net, collect your checks, then buy your jet. Step four, there is no step four. <laughs> I'm so sorry for using a still frame of you with your eyes closed. Oh wait, no I'm not. If you got $300, what would you do with it? I'd use it to buy the I Am Rich Pro 2018 app. And at first, I thought this was a very shoddily made Photoshop you sent me. No, 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 no. This is depressingly real. Turns out there are a whole slew of I Am Rich apps you can buy for your smartphone. For example, this one costs you $400, and somehow this got 100,000 downloads. So if you do the math, this company has already made $40 million off of people. We're all doing it wrong. Design a flag for Earth. Now there have been a number of proposals for flags for Earth, but none of them are official. And honestly, none of them are up to the YAI standard that I know you guys can rise up to. <laughs> I physically hurt looking at this. A couple of days ago, some seemingly authentic art from the upcoming Sonic movie was leaked. And if you can believe it, the internet wasn't happy. Granted, the internet is never happy, will never be happy, and will die angry. Fix it! Fix the Sonic! Fix it! Hey, you know what Sonic's missing? His gun. <laughs> His trademark gun. Gotta go fast. What will the post credit scene be in Avengers Endgame? <laughs> Uncle Ben dies. <laughs> yeah, he's the worst Avenger. <laughs> that poor guy just dies all the time. <laughs> Your best roses are red poems, and hopefully, we'll never have to do this again. Roses are red, violets atrocious. I would be dead without plants in osmosis. Made you learn. How is Game of Thrones going to end? This Sunday is the last episode we'll ever get. What's the big ending? Uh, meow. <laughs> <laughs> fake facts for, fake facts for. Put your hands together for some fake facts for. We did this thrice, but you wanted more. Put your hands together for some fake facts for. Keeping a child after class is illegal, and if a teacher does so, you can sue. Oh. This is a great start. Let me elaborate. Teachers legally cannot hold a classroom past the end of a class. When they say, you bound to dismiss you, I do. They are violating federal law. <laughs> no, they're not. Shove that in the teacher's face and go, boom, roasted. And then they'll be like, where's the source? And you can be like, shut up, fill in the blanks. A group of blank is called a blank. <laughs> a group of all the people who truly love Jack's films it's called a couple. <laughs> Thanks, mom and dad. If you were able to bamboozle anyone with those fake facts from a few days ago. Remember that fake fact about how Ukraine had to change Thanos' name to Yegor for reasons? And here are the responses. Huh? Do you know this? No, I don't speak Ukrainian. But you are Ukrainian. Did we just bamboozle a Ukrainian? about a Ukrainian thing. Forgive me if I sound cocky, but this is my proudest bamboozle. Ooh, what is the worst possible YouTuber merch you can think of? This isn't a joke. I just saw a kid wearing a tee with the angry birds on it and the text, epic win. This is another shirt. You can just slap any YouTube face on it and the <laughs> epic win below. <laughs> Oh my god, why is that not a thing? So recently, Fortnite took my move, and it's fine, you know, I'm not gonna do anything about it, and I think the whole thing is kind of funny, to be honest, but what if it happened to you? Make an apology video for making a Fortnite emote. <laughs> Damn it, that's what I should have done. Can we please give this poor woman some eyeballs? It sickens me to look at this. No. No, this is the worst one yet, and now I'm mad. Look, I am so down to storm Area 51 with you guys, but what is actually there in Area 51? I feel like we should know what's at stake here. The woman that is attracted to me. Oh, buddy, you wanna talk? Saddest thing I've heard in a while. Help me fix the cat's trailer. Help me fix this and this and that from Zarkex. Another deep fake, but this time, you put my wife Erin's face on all the cats, and I mean 
all of them. Somehow this looks so much worse. You can even see all the bits of emotion on her face when she sings or cries or whatever. It's very well done and also nightmare fuel. What is the worst possible thing you would want to hear from your Uber driver? Let's go. What's Uber? In just four words, can you describe YouTube? <laughs> Sweaty man-child pranks. <laughs> what YouTube are you watching? Can you link me? Help me create the most cursed comment section in all of YouTube. <laughs> Why? What if we pissed in the ball pit together? Haha, <laughs> JK. Unless... <laughs> oh, and then this guy commented under that, you can't have the pasta without the sauce. <laughs> what is your signature catchphrase? Imagine you're a character on a sitcom and you come bursting in through the front door. What's that quotable, famous catchphrase of yours that America loves? Oopsie doopsie, I made a fucky wucky. <laughs> if you could make some Tinder profiles for my wife and myself. <laughs> Apparently my Tinder profile reads, Looking for a boyfriend for my wife. You're now banned from Yai. Green screen memes. So a couple of days ago, I gave you all some terrible uh, green screen templates for you to insert into your memes. This is what you were looking for, right? Jax Films, play with sound. Please don't ever tell me how to play something. I'll play with sound, but not because you told me to. Uh, right off the bat, I uh, love the watermark. A brilliant idea putting white text on a bright green background. Nobody steal this, please. Thank you. Yes! God, yes. Yikes. A plus plus plus? The amount of editing is disgusting. Knobbly Productions, I'm so sorry for making fun of your watermark earlier. Happy spooked over. We have a tradition where for every day in October, I change up my Twitter avatar to one of your lovely creations. And this is at least the sixth year we've done this. Yes. Karen. Facebook's favorite anti-vaxxing mom. She doesn't vaccinate her kids, but she makes a damn good casserole. Also, her kids are dead. <laughs> Describe boomers in just four words. Don't understand Shrek porn. Those stupid boomers, they'll never get it. <laughs> Let me fix your avatars and profile pics. Haven't changed this picture for eight years. Eight years, huh? Time for a tune-up. There's so much that could be happening on the left side of the frame. I have a terrible idea. First, I need a shot of me with an empty dog leash out in front, as if my dog just escaped. I record a few takes of that just in case, then picked one frame and went to work. Next, I needed a shot of Klondike walking toward camera, because once you add a little motion blur, it really looks like a shot from a Planet Earth documentary. You're looking at the last few seconds of my dog's life. Neato! <laughs> Describe all of the 2010s, but in just four words. The good old days. <laughs> this is a very pessimistic way to look at the world. <laughs> that means it's only downhill from here. What are your predictions for this year's YouTube Rewind? The portal scene from Endgame where YouTubers, uh, this, this hurts to read, where YouTubers go through the portals with diamond pickaxes, then they proceed to raid Area 51 with revenge playing in the background. I think you're onto something with the portal scene from Endgame being terribly recreated in Rewind. You just got canceled. What do you do? Oh, you can load up an old save file. Just start over. <laughs> what should the official flag of Yai look like? This next flag looks simple, but way too much thought went into it. Two by three ratio reflects the eye's origin date, February 3rd. The six pointed star represents all the six roses are red episodes. The green star is for all four of my music, your lyrics episodes. The blue star is for Avatar and all of its sequels. And the pink star is for all the in just four words episodes, of course. Probably the most thoughtful flag. How should I tell our dogs they're adopted? Hey, bark if you're not adopted. Good girl. That's right. Help me write a Christmas song. I'm bloody underneath the mistletoe. 
leave your presents in the stockings below. Make me more festive. I'm not in the Christmas spirit yet and I don't know what to do. I gave you guys some pictures and I painted out all my clothes so that you could do a fun little dress them up kind of thing. Draw the Raven on Twitter. Way to subvert expectations in quite the clever way. But not even just that, this has, I think, the best Photoshop out of all of our submissions. You deleted the Christmas tree somehow. You color corrected all of the little bows and ribbons to be blue. Even the elf on the shelf is now blue. So much work, care, and detail went into this Yai submission. You, you know this is Yai, right? What was the worst Christmas gift you got this year? Oh no. <laughs> I don't know what's cooler, the baby mask or the God is dope shirt. What if you made this your Tinder pick? <laughs> Describe your billion dollar app idea. What's your app that's gonna zuck your way to disgusting wealth? I hit a button and it gives me a ridiculous kids bop lyric. Great idea, but then Elijah on Twitter responds with, just made this, does it fit? So I click the link and oh my God, it is a Kids Bop random lyric generator. <laughs> but even better, because when you click the random button, it gives you the original song lyric and then how Kids Bop uh, changed it. Let's give it a whirl. From with every broken bone I swear I lived to, with every broken heart, I swear I live. That's pretty good. From, cause I love living in the sin, to, cause I just try to make it win? Ew. More. From, I gave you bass, you gave me sweet talk, to, I gave you love, you gave me sweet talk. I thought they were gonna change sweet talk. From, the bed's getting cold and you're not here, to, the world's getting cold. <laughs> Yes! Hold on, just a few more. From, she told me in the morning, she don't feel the same about us in her bones, to, she told me in the hallway, no! She don't feel the same about us in her bones! They kept bones! Okay Google, does morning rhyme with hallway? Oh, it doesn't at all? From, will your mouth still remember the taste of my love? Very scandalous. To, will your mouth still remember the look of my love? No! Elijah, you are the first hero of the 2020s. Spice up my tour bus. I gave you some templates of a boring old tour bus, so let's see how you did. Let's go back to John Bob. You remember this one, right? Well, John Bob came back and made a hideous 3D model for some reason, complete with very clappable cheeks. This bus would cause so many accidents. John Bob, let me talk to my tour people and see if they can't pimp my bus. What creeps you out? When people are making out inside of an olive garden. Okay, that is way too specific. There's clearly some story here. Also, I've never been to an olive garden, so is this a thing? And if it is, uh, what the hell olive garden? How are you killing the time in all this epic self-isolation? Chopping carrots to make soup. Why is the soup in quotation marks? Why? This is a really creepy and cryptic answer. Even the guy below is like, I'm so uncomfortable. What does this mean? Simp. It's the hot, sexy buzzword everyone's talking about. Well, except for the real thing everyone's talking about. But did you know that simp actually stands for something? What does simp actually stand for? <laughs> <laughs> this guy wrote seven inch minion penis and then included a very unnecessary picture. Mm -mm. 